Why do you need them? A Friday night surprise. After weeks of political and public pressure, David Johnston stepping down as the special rapporteur investigating foreign interference in Canadian elections. Johnson writing in his resignation letter to the Prime Minister, when I undertook the task of independent special rapporteur on foreign interference, my objective was to help build trust in our democratic institutions. I have concluded that given the highly partisan atmosphere around my appointment and work, my leadership has had the opposite effect. We had uh, tasked David Johnston to do the report that he did and make recommendations. Uh, he did excellent work. Now we're looking at the next steps. This uh, rapporteur process uh, needed to end and we need to have an open public, transparent inquiry. In his initial report, Johnston concluded a full public inquiry was not a suitable option, but the federal government says it's now considering all options and challenging the opposition. Make suggestions about who could lead this public inquiry. What would the terms of reference be? What do they see as the timelines? How do they deal with the obvious challenge of respecting Canadian law that protects some of the most sensitive intelligence information? Trudeau has asked Dominic LeBlanc to figure out next steps by consulting with experts and legal scholars, some who are already suggesting an inquiry. We need to actually be very careful with our expectations, right? Um, foreign interference is some of the most close hold intelligence that the government actually has, and we've seen that in the various leaks that have come out. Johnston's work was overshadowed by opposition concerns about his relationship with the Prime Minister and his family. Now that he's gone, experts say it's time for politicians to work together. These people have it within them to do it. They need to resist their worst instincts and get on with the job to which they are elected. And now far all parties want some input in terms of who's going to be in charge next. The federal government says it's crucial to do it right the second time to ensure there's trust from the public in our institutions. Farah? Thank you, Richard. That's Richard Zussman reporting from Victoria.